Previously on Birth by Sleep. <sighs> A meteor shower. <sighs> Whoa! Hard to believe there are so many worlds out there besides our own. The light is their hearts, and it's shining down on us like a million lanterns. Today you will be examined for the mark of mastery. Not one, but two of the Keyblades chosen stand here as candidates. But this is neither a competition nor a battle for supremacy. Not a test of wills, but a test of heart. What do you make of Ventus? He ain't gonna cut it. Somebody's got to break that loser in. Not here, you won't. I have to keep up appearances. I know that. He just needs a little incentive to leave home. Monsters. The ones the Master mentioned. These are the Unburst. No, you don't! this? Why aren't you asleep, boy? That fool Slora cast a spell to put everyone in this castle into a deep, deep slumber. Who are you? Why, I am Maleficent, as all who dwell in this kingdom would know. 
Now you must reciprocate the introduction. Who are you? I'm Terra. What do you know about those monsters? The ones who attacked me? Hmm. Now why would I give a thought to creatures so base, so inconsequential? <laughs> well, they are base. That's for sure. Anyway, I'm looking for someone. Ever heard of a man named Xehanort? That name is not familiar to me. Is he an outsider like yourself? Oh, but wait. I do remember someone leaving the castle. Tell me, what was he doing there? I couldn't say. I can only be certain he was not from this kingdom. If you're curious, go see the castle for yourself. There, the entrance is past the bridge. Thanks. <laughs> Perhaps he did speak about imprisoning the light. The light could be so many things. Could he have meant Princess Aurora? Aurora. This feels so familiar. Her heart is filled with light. Not the slightest touch of darkness. Just the kind of heart I need. For what? Imagine with me the most glorious of futures. Seven of the purest hearts, each overflowing with light. When brought together, they grant the power to rule all worlds. What do you mean? Why, that key you hold. The Keyblade, is it called? Where did you learn that name? That trinket is the only way to obtain the hearts. No more games! Where is Master Xehanort? Impudence will get you nowhere, child. If you wish to learn more, you must retrieve the heart of Aurora. And why would I ever want to do that? It's not a matter of why, but of will. In your heart, there is darkness just waiting to be awakened. <sighs> I don't know what you're talking about. Perhaps not yet. <sighs> but I have power over <sighs> sleep. And I can awaken what's inside you. Then you will be free to be who you truly are. Remember, the darkness lurks in every heart. Darkness is our foe. Would that we could be rid of it. You must destroy it. Push the darkness down. Give it no quarter in your heart. Just what I've waited for. <sighs> to think that all he spoke of was and will be true. What? How did I... <sighs> what did I do? What did you do? You speak as if I pulled some invisible strings. No. You couldn't be further from the truth, child. I simply whispered to the darkness you already held inside. How could I do this? 
Finn! Yes. Now, you want to know where Xehanort went. Well, that I cannot answer. He disappeared into the darkness. But now I know the Keyblade is necessary to gather hearts. Join me. Collect six more hearts of pure light. Then we will rule all the world together! You seem to be mixed up. I'm a peacekeeper, not a tyrant. Hmm. For a peacekeeper, you're off to an exceptionally poor start. Remember this. The darkness in your heart cannot be held back by force or strength. Now, my work here is done, as is yours. Wasn't there someone you needed to change? He unburst. They're gonna bring down the castle. I have to do something. It's my fault her light was stolen. It was because I was weak. I'm sorry. I'll get your light back. Once I learn to stand up against the darkness. Why would Master Xehanort imprison the light? The purest hearts of light. Do they hold the answer? Seven pure hearts, each completely void of darkness. Such a search may take some time. Spirit of the Mirror, come from the farthest space. Through wind and darkness, I summon thee! Speak! Show me thy face! What wouldst thou know, my queen? Magic mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest one of all? Famed is thy beauty, majesty, but hold a lovely maid I see. Alas, she is more fair than thee. 
Alas for her. Reveal her name. Lips red as the rose, hair black as ebony, skin white as snow. Oh, snow white. A mirror that knows and sees everything. How about that? The heart of Snow White doth shine bright. Beware, my queen, a heart of light. Another one? Wait. What if Master Xehanort is here? <gasps> Who goes there? My name is Terra. I'm looking for a man named Xehanort. Master Xehanort. I thought maybe you might have seen him. That name is of no consequence to me. Wait. Ah, yes. I have a task for you. If you succeed, I will ask the mirror where you might find this Master Xehanort. And the mirror will know? Do you dare to question me? What is the task? <laughs> there is a young maid who resides in this castle. Her name is Snow White. Kill her. And to make sure you do not fail, bring back her heart in this. Her heart? I don't understand. You're after the Hearts of Light too? What I demand is her life. I've had more than enough of her light. What did this maiden do to you? That is no concern of yours. Now, heed my words. My radiance is all the light this kingdom needs. <laughs> Where can I find her? Outside the castle. There is a glade of wildflowers. You are dismissed. Go now and seek her there. A heart of light. This Snow White is my best chance right now. Maybe she will lead me closer to Master Xehanort. But what if I... No, I won't let that happen. I wonder if that's her. Oh! Oh, hello. Who are you? Aren't you startled? Should I be? It's true, then. Her heart is pure light. She's the one. Is something the matter? Does the name Xehanort mean anything to you? Why, why no. I don't think I've ever heard that name. Now what? <laughs> Unversed! <laughs> hey, wait! Don't go in there alone! Out of my way! Lost her. She said she doesn't know anything about Master Xehanort. That leaves me with just one other option. The mirror. Back at the castle. How dare you return here, you blundering fool! What are you talking about? <laughs> I ordered you to bring me Snow White's heart. 
a request I chose to ignore. You know, you claim to be radiant, but all I see are shadows of jealousy hanging thick on your heart. You will pay for such insolence. Magic mirror on the wall, consume this fool once and for all. Alas, my liege, that I cannot do. I have no power save answers true. Huh? You dare defy your queen? <gasps> what? Did you escape? Now you will ask the mirror. Where can I find Master Xehanort? <sighs> Magic mirror, instruct this knave. Give him the answers he doth crave. Beyond both light and dark he dwells, where war was waged upon the fells. Is that all? Thanks. You've been a big help. Hmm. Is something wrong? It's just that my friends made me the most beautiful dress, but my stepmother and stepsisters ruined it, and I was so looking forward to the ball. <laughs> Darkness always finds a way into a wounded heart. You have to be strong. Strength of heart will carry you through the hardest of trials. But I... Unversed! Heart is huh? important, but that's not all huh? you need. Huh? There's nothing left to believe in. Nothing. Nothing, my dear. Oh, now, you don't really mean that. Oh, but I do. It's just no use. 
Nonsense. If you'd lost all your faith, I couldn't be here. And here I am. Oh, come now. Dry those tears. You can't go to the ball looking like that. The ball? Oh, but I'm not. Of course you are. But we'll have to hurry. Now, what were those magic words? Oh, yes. Like all dreams, I'm afraid this can't last forever. You'll have only till midnight, and then on the stroke of twelve, the spell will be broken, and everything will be as it was before. Yes, I understand. full of light. Why didn't I see it? What did you do? I can hardly tell she's the same person. Who are you? Tara. Tara, in your heart, do you believe that dreams can come true? I do. But I also believe you have to make an effort to make them come true. Yes, of course. But sometimes just believing in dreams is easier said than done. Cinderella believes her dreams can come true. I wanted her to see that she is right. So that's what made her shine. Faith in her heart that anything is possible. Where did she go? To the royal ball at the palace. Go, and when you see her dancing, you'll know that she believes, and that will help you to believe too. Here too. I've met you before. I'll take care of them. You wait right here. Please, may I go with you? I so want to get to the ball. Um. All right. But stay behind me, or you'll get hurt. <laughs> You're not worried? Didn't you tell me it was important to stay strong? Oh. Um, I guess I did. <laughs> <laughs> so, you ready? Yes. Ah! <laughs> 
Thank you, um... Terra. Thank you, Terra. Maybe just believing is enough. But who is she, Mother? Do we know her? Well, the Prince certainly seems to. I've never seen her before. Nor I. But she certainly is. Wait. There is something familiar about her. Unversed. <laughs> Tell me, how do I get up there? Um, well, uh, there is a passage beneath the foyer staircase. Thanks. Saved us all. <sighs> the guests were just starting to enjoy themselves. Well, don't give up just yet. Oh. Tell me something. Have you always had a problem around here with those monsters? No. I believe uh, they began to appear shortly after a boy in a mask arrived in our kingdom. Those that saw him said the monsters obeyed his every command. A boy in a mask? Do you know where he is now? Well, no. I don't believe anyone has seen him since then. I see. Oh, my goodness. It's midnight. Yes, so it is. But why? Goodbye. Wait. Come back! Please come back! I'm sorry! The Mademoiselle! Uh, Senorita! Uh, wait! Aqua! Tara! Tara, Ven ran away from home. What? I think he left to go find you. 
Do you have any idea why? No. Huh. Actually, just before I left, he tried to tell me something. I should have listened to what he had to say. Oh. So, did you manage to locate Master Zaynort? No, but it seems he's looking for pure hearts filled with light. Pure hearts filled with light? All I can tell you is that his search hasn't taken him here. Alright. I'll stay and see if I can find more clues. Okay. The prince is in the ballroom ahead. He might have some answers. Thanks. Aqua! You still have the same dream? Well, yes. There's this girl here. Her name is Cinderella. She made me realize how powerful it is just to believe. No matter how impossible things seem, a powerful enough dream will always be enough to light the darkness. Mm. If you see her, give her my thanks. Will do. The boy in the mask who is leading the unversed. Who is he? Does he have anything to do with Master Xehanort's disappearance? Master Ericus said he first received word of these events from Master Yen Sid. Maybe it's time I went and spoke with him myself. Next time on Birth by Sleep. I have been to other worlds. I know all about the things you've done. I just don't understand why. Someone had to safeguard the light from the demon I unleashed. You must know about the boy by now, the one in the mask. His name is Vanitas, a creature of pure darkness, one of my making. Vanitas? Are you telling me he came from you? He came from Ventus.